emptied out my soul You've heard it all before Honest but I know uh -huh. Left these years ago I was young and I'm old Still care for the void uh -huh. We don't need the past in our lives for tomorrow Never see the end of the night for a sorrow What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done What do we do to love? Good morning you guys welcome back to my channel I know it's been a while since I've vlogged um, a little over a week but I just wanted a little bit more of a break before I started to get back into my regular uploading schedule which will be like two to three days a week like usual um, but I'm back and I think this is my first vlog of 2020 so happy new year we just got home from the gym I am like obsessed with my Apple watch right now especially for the gym because I try to make sure I get all my rings closed and now I'm like competing with my friends and I have like David's on here too it's so much fun if you guys have an Apple watch let me know like what some of your stats are and if you're like addicted to closing your rings like I am because it's so fun and I feel like it keeps me more motivated yesterday was Sunday and I typically don't do any physical activity but we went for a walk which we're trying to do every Sunday and I like forced myself to like jog a little bit during it so that I could like get my calories um, up and like get my workouts done so it's a good motivator if you need one but anyways we just got home I think I'm gonna like uh, make the kids some lunch and stuff and then this afternoon they have their well checkups so I don't know I guess this is Cal's three-year checkup um, he's just a little bit late on it because he turned three in August. So this will be his three-year-old checkup and then this will be Cruz. I don't know what this one is, but he's 16 months old. So they both have their well baby checkups today. So um, I will be updating you guys on how that goes, but I don't know. Oh, we've got our grocery pickup too. Um, I don't know how much we can like show and do like with the kids now on YouTube because I know like all those changes went into effect um in 2020 
so I'm not sure like this weekend we went to a really fun aquarium and stuff and I brought my camera and then I ended up not vlogging because I wasn't sure I wasn't sure if that would be like intended for kids and I would get like demonetized and stuff so I don't know I'm not really sure I'm trying to like tiptoe and see how this goes but as you guys know my channel is meant for moms not for children so I may have to start doing even like showing my kids even less um, but I'll definitely still be like doing updates on things like you know all that kind of stuff just maybe not showing those much who knows we'll see so I put away all of our Christmas decor on January 1st our tree is gone I've never put stuff away that early before but now it's kind of just a mixture I put some like farmhouse stuff that I've had out in the spring I put that here um, I just got this really cute Ray Dunn piece from TJ Maxx for Valentine's Day and then I have like some little heart, string hearts there but I still have reindeers because it's still January so I don't know that's kind of what I have and then I did do my coffee bar for Valentine's Day over here and then our kitchen table. I think the kitchen table turned out really cute too. I think I got this last year at Pier 1 on clearance. Um, and then I just have this little XO sign. And I put some stuff at the kids table. And I just have another one of these hearts. But I think I might go to, actually I'm gonna go to Target tomorrow. So I may check out their, actually I know I will. I'll check out their dollar spot and stuff and see if they have any more like, just like cute little like touches because I want some more Valentine's stuff in here. I also want some new pillows in here as well. All right, for lunch, I'm heating up some leftover Panda Express. Someone is hangry. The boys are gonna have some noodles, and then this is my Panda Express from last night. All right, the boys just went down for a nap, hopefully. So I'm making some coffee. I really wanna get a new coffee machine. I like this one, but it's like three years old. And I think it's time to replace it. It has this clean light and I clean it like I just cleaned it last week, not even a week ago. And the light's already back on. <clears throat> so I think it's just time to replace it. But anyways, if you guys know of a good one, let me know. I kind of want to try an espresso, but I don't know if it's worth it. But yeah, I need a new coffee machine. And then the kitchen is kind of... <sighs> Honestly, it doesn't look that bad on camera, but in real life, it is a disaster. Like, I need to wipe down the counters. I've got some dishes to put away. But I think I'm going to sit down and just, like, sit and drink my coffee and watch a show for a few minutes because I am, like, exhausted. Life is a winding road. No telling where it goes. Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Let me figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down I will keep on searching for my highs Say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down. All right, we just hopped in the car now to head to the doctor's office. Hopefully I won't be late this time. We should, we should have plenty of time. It's just the last couple of times that I've been there, I've been a few minutes late and it's been a huge fiasco. And last time I had a huge meltdown, <laughs> literally cried. So hopefully that doesn't happen again. Tell me who to be. Okay, we need number five. Oh, 
five. Yes, press the five. Oh, so, um, are we going all the way up? We are going all the way up. <laughs> I'm making sloppy joes without the bun, and then I'm making that cauliflower stuff that's like the cauliflower cheesy stuff. <laughs> Sound good? <laughs> so enthusiastic. <laughs> All right, hey, gentle back there, mister. Hi there, doctor appointment, yeah. Um, it went really good. Okay. That was my husband, obviously, on the phone. I was just waiting for our grocery pickup. We just got done at the doctor's. Everything went great. They had a good checkup, each of them. Um, crew is in the third percentile for weight he's 19 pounds at 16 months and so I, that was one of my concerns is just like and i think i ask her this every time like is he okay is he growing okay and she's always like yep he's fine so she was like yeah he's growing he's still on the chart growing he's fine and i was like okay he doesn't drink that much milk like the way cal did um i actually got him pediasure and he's like he kind of drinks it a little bit, but he doesn't seem to like love it. I got him vanilla, so I might try to get him a different flavor or something. But she said it's nothing like he needs to go on any like formula or anything like that. It's just, he's just smaller. So I don't know, but I'm interested if any of you guys have small babies, like do you give them anything extra to help them? Like I just feel like he needs, I don't know. He's just, he's also a very, very picky eater at such a young age. He's already like leaning towards the sweeter stuff and like throwing like everything else on the floor so we're at that stage already with him but otherwise everything is good and we're just here picking up our groceries so we can go home and i can make some dinner tonight all right i just unbagged our groceries i'll show you guys a few things that i got i got this like stuffed chicken breasts um, just something that I could try for lunch. I don't know if it'll be any good. And then this one as well. Never heard of this brand, Performance Kitchen. But I'm always looking for quick and easy meals um, to eat at home. So I'm going to try those this week. Vegetables, fruit. I'm super excited that Walmart now has pre-cut zucchini noodles. So I'm going to do a zucchini um, turkey meatballs with zucchini and marinara. Um, this week. I'm also going to do another cook with me video this month for you guys because a lot of people seem to really like that. So we've got more stuff. I'm going to try these for the kids. Um, let's see. Sloppy Joe's tonight. I got pineapple for a snack for me. I read that it's like really good for I don't know. Like it's a really healthy snack if you're a snacker. So I decided I'm gonna try that this week. Cauliflower, squash, lettuce, spinach, ground beef. Who wants to stand? <laughs> um, and then I got these. This is what I really wanted to show you guys. So I got two new coffee creamers to try. This one is Stoke Fueled Creamer with MCT oil and protein in original flavor. So I'm hoping that's good. And then this one sounded amazing. The oatmeal cookie, silk oat milk creamer. This sounds so good. But you guys, my favorite one ever has to be the Ready Whip um, cream, creamy foam, foam creamer, whatever that one is. That one is amazing. It's just really hard to find. They don't have it at Walmart. They don't have it at Target. Um, so I haven't been able to find it except for one grocery store. Um, so I just went with these this week, but yeah, there's our Grocery order for the week. All right. I just made their dinner. We've got this um, This is a cheesy cauliflower casserole. It is so good. I'm actually making it um, Again tonight for dinner Meatballs corn and oranges I want to see the meatballs. Does it look good? I know meatballs. Yeah yeah. Let's go put it at your at the table. Table. All right, you guys. I'm gonna end today's video. Um, 
I'm gonna start cooking dinner soon. I'm gonna edit this vlog so that I can have it up tomorrow. I will be filming what I'm making for dinner tonight so that I can post a what's for dinner video. Sometime this month, I will also have an Amazon video coming this month. It's gonna be my favorite health and fitness items to purchase on Amazon, so that'll be a fun one to look forward to. But anyways, uh, David and I just started a new show called The Circle. It's on Netflix, and it's so funny. If you like like silly reality shows and Big Brother, you will love it. So we started that, so we have that to watch tonight. And I think we're gonna start Love, A Love Island. Um, cause that sounds like another one we would like. Anyways, anyways guys, thanks for watching today's video. I will see you in another vlog on Thursday. But we get up and start from the ground.